Welcome to Star Technology 5G. In today video I will show you how to operate DC motor using PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Let's start the video. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G and click on the bell icon. What is a DC motor? Generally, an electric motor is a machine that converts electrical energy into mechanical energy. An electric motor operated by DC, direct current, is known as a DC motor. A DC motor converts DC electrical energy into mechanical energy. DC motors are used in a wide variety of different devices and appliances that play a part in our lives. Here is picture of DC motor and here is the DC motor symbol. Construction of DC motor A DC machine consists of two main components, stator and rotor. Stator is the stationary part whereas rotor is the rotating part. Stator of DC machine consists of yoke, field winding, interpoles, compensating winding, brushes and end cover. Rotor consists of armature core, armature winding, commutator and shaft. A labeled diagram of DC machine is shown below. Here is shaft. That is armature conductor. That is field winding. That is pole shoe. That is yoke or frame. That is commutator. That is interpole. The rotor is normally located inside of the motor, while the stator is located on the outside. The rotor contains coil windings that are powered by the DC current and the stator contains either permanent magnets or electromagnetic windings. You can see in this figure these are permanent magnets that is stator. And inside is the rotor and here is rotor winding. How a DC motor works? When the DC motor is powered by DC current, a magnetic field is created within the stator, attracting and repelling the magnets on the rotor. This causes the rotor to start rotating. You can see in this figure when power is applied to the DC motor rotors winding get magnetized and repel the rotor and rotor start rotating. Project, how to interface DC motor using L293D. In this project, we will connect DC motor with PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. We are using L293D IC that is motor driver circuit. A switch is connected with RD0 pin of the microcontroller, if we press the switch motor will rotate clockwise direction and if we release the switch motor will rotate anti-clockwise direction. Here is the circuit diagram we are using in our project. It is PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Pin number 1 is master reset. If we press the switch it will reset the microcontroller. Port C interfaced with L293D. Pin 8 and 16 connected with positive 12 volts. Pin 4, 5, 12, 13 connected with ground. The output of L293D connected with DC motor. RD0 pin interfaced with switch 1. That is pull up resistors and the value of resistors is 4.7K. If we press the switch motor will rotate clockwise direction and if we release the switch motor will rotate anti-clockwise direction. Pin numbers 13 and 14 interfaced with an 8 MHz crystal. And 22 PF capacitors connected with the crystal. Pin number 11 and 32 connected with positive 5 volts. Pin number 12 and 31 connected with ground volt. Let draw this circuit in Proteus.
Circuit is ready now we will write it code in micro C for pick. Here is the window where we can write the code. I already wrote the code otherwise video gets very long. I will copy the code. And I will paste it here. Now I will define the code. S bit MTR1 at port C. B0. Define port C pin RC0 as MTR1. S bit MTR2 at port C. B1. Define port C pin RC1 as MTR2. S bit EN at port C. B2. Define port C pin RC2 as EN. S bit SW at port D. B0. Define port D pin RD0 as switch. Void. Main. Main function. TRISC. RC0 equals 0. Set port C pin RC0 as output pin. TRISC RC1 equals 0 Set port C pin RC1 as output pin TRISC RC2 equals 0 Set port C pin RC2 as output pin TRISD RD0 equals 1 Set port D pin RD0 as input pin EN equals 0 Clear EN pin MTR1 equals 0. Clear MTR1 pin. MTR2 equals 0. Clear MTR2 pin. While. 1. Repeat forever loop. EN equals 1. Enable N pin. If SW equals equals 1. If switch pressed. It will rotate motor in clockwise direction. MTR1 equals 1. MTR1 pin equal to logic 1. MTR2 equals 0. MTR2 pin equal to logic 0. Else. If switch not pressed. It will rotate motor in anti-clockwise direction. MTR1 equals 0. MTR1 pin equal to logic 0. MTR2 equals 1. MTR2 pin equal to logic 1. Now we will create the hex file. Just click on the build icon. Finished successfully. File is created now we will load hex file into the microcontroller. Double click on the microcontroller. Select the hex file. OK. And click on the run simulation. If we press the switch it will rotate the motor in anti-clockwise direction. And if we release the switch it will rotate the motor in clockwise direction. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G. And keep watching Star Technology 5G.